do here it is poison aura they poison me okay i killed you here it is this guy will kill you and afterwards i have two more action points in order for me to kill him and with just one blow i did okay so you're going to advance in the campaign you're going to have a lot lot of side quests you can swap your heroes and you can choose the ones that are with the thumbs up because those are going to do more damage towards your enemies than the previous ones and also you can swap the weapon here it is this one is a better one because these guys are with cult or with undead here it is some of the enemies go under your shield in a way and they will go towards your life from the first hit so you do want to take those enemies out first welcome and check out knighthood over here on idle games tv now played it for one week this game is definitely old enough for you to try it but you can give it a try because they did a lot lot of improvements regarding this game so you're going to have one main character one main knight you can choose different kind of things that you're going to be able to put on him different kind of armors you're going to have a lot a lot of heroes that you can choose along your side in order for you to try to do your best in this game now you're going to get your daily rewards out of it obviously you do want to complete all all the quests over here in order for you to get everything now after you're going to jump into a fight you're going to be able to choose two heroes and the main weapon that you do want to carry every time you're going to jump into a fight you're going to consume some energy over here now if you have played it and you're a veteran player for sure you can drop some comments in order for us to know some tips and tricks regarding this game this is a really really nice and interesting rpg game unfortunately it's not idle unfortunately so you're going to have up to four actions that you can place over here i do suggest the fact that you should do three afterwards with the sword and the fourth one you should try to do it with your really really big fist that you can have over here now what i mean by that every time you're going to hit with your fist you're going to load an energy point over here okay now if you're going to load enough if that fist will load up you're going to be able to choose a specific skill from these guys over here okay now this guy for example does ice damage the other one has a bow over here here it is he, uh, your enemies have shield but also have life so you do want to penetrate the shield afterwards you're going to be able to uh, cut their life in half some of the enemies go under your shield in a way and they will go towards your life from the first hit so you do want to take those enemies out first if you're going to start this game now you're going to be able to get a lot out of gear out of this game you do need to play it daily eventually your energy will end up and you're going to need to go offline you do have some ads that you can watch in order for you to get some extra extra rewards some gold coins that you're going to need now here it is it is better for you to kill the uh, other one not this tank over here but unfortunately i wasn't paying attention but here it is uh, here it is knock out now if you're going to do the last blow with your punch is going to add up more and more energy towards the punch and it's going to be really really interesting now as i mentioned you do want to take out these guys over here in order for you to be able to uh, he oh come on i wasn't paying attention here it is now the fist now here it is now i am able to choose one of these heroes i'm able to choose one of the skills okay so i'm going to go for this guy over here here it is it is this is his ultimate skill now let's uh okay you killed only one but decent enough okay not you let's go for the ah come on only one action point sorry by mistake but it's doable so the guys from behind you cannot touch him until uh you're going to be able to kill the ones in the front so that uh, quite sucks but hey you do need to play it like you do need to play it here it is ah come on dude i thought i killed you so he's coming in front as a tank in order for the other guys to try to do their best try to do here it is poison aura they poison me okay i killed you here it is this guy will kill you and afterwards i have two more action points in order for me to kill him and with just one blow i did okay so you're going to advance in the campaign you're going to have a lot lot of side quests you're going to have a big big map that you do need to follow different kind of quests you can click on the screen and you will attack with the sword or you can click on the punch and you will attack with the punch easy as that not that hard okay you're just going to need to follow the simple simple quest besides that you're going to have some ads over here uh, free free rewards a lot a lot of gold coins different kind of gemstones that you're going to be able to get out of this game now you're going to have some vaults that you can open you can have vaults with ads also you're going to have equipment uh, 
ones over here as well you can put real money in the game that's going to be up to you a lot lot of items that you're going to be able to collect you can dismantle them in order for you to get different kind of parts and afterwards you're going to be able to enhance other weapons that you do desire to do that here it is i'm going to be able to upgrade my uh, my fist over here all weapons plus three percent damage really important the gauntlet is really really important you're going to need it quite quite a lot okay now you're going to need to put uh, a lot lot of effort in this game in order for you to actually uh, go further than i did honestly didn't play it that much although i played it a week didn't play it that much now over here in the store you're going to have real option uh, with real cash but also over here in the chest option you're going to be able to get eventually a freer gem chest a free gem chest and a free gold chest please try to get them when you're going to see the red dot on the store in order for you to be able to get more and more resources now we're going to have the world over here you do need to travel quite quite a lot the game is really really big now i do mention the fact that it's really really big and you're going to need to play it more than i did as i mentioned you're going to be able to have even a guild and in the guild you're going to be able to have guild wars the game it's awesome you should give it a try if you hadn't had the possibility until now you're going to have different kind of mines now from those mines you're going to be able to get different kind of resources that you will use in order for you to do more and more upgrades towards your weapons towards your armor and so on you're going to have different kind of types of armor from what i saw uh, you're going to have so light and heavy as you can see over here you can choose this one in order for you to uh, change the rarity the green ones are a different kind of rarity uh, you can improve this ones as well every time you're going to hit level 10 you will need to rank up this those uh, specific items not that hard of a rpg game but unfortunately it's not an idle game unfortunately played it a bit give it a try for sure you can go further further than me for sure you're going to have a lot a lot of fun in it different kind of fights that you're going to be able right now uh, to have right now i'm trying to kill a lot a lot of undead people now on the top of the screen you're going to have a bar over there it kind of indicates the fact that uh, you are able or not to kill those enemies uh, obviously you're going to need to have a specific strategy in order for you to kill all of those uh, enemies that you do not uh, let's say can pass let's go back because i do want to show you something you can change your heroes i'm going to hit quit you can change your heroes so for example when you're going to enter the battle over here in the prepare option you can swap your heroes and you can choose the ones that are with the thumbs up because those are going to do more damage towards your enemies than the previous ones and also you can swap the weapon here it is this one is a better one because these guys are with cult or with undead here it is now this is this these things uh, increase my chance of winning this fight so this is what you're going to want to do okay swap between the heroes and the weapons if you're going to see that you're going to have an extra benefit until next time take care be safe don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button and drop some comments with different kind of games that you do want me to take a look over here be safe. Bye.